hey y'all it's Harriana and I'm back with another video so today oh I'm gonna be honest with y'all I'm not doing okay this quarantine is uh, it's it's terrible I'm not doing okay I'm I lowly feel like I'm losing my mind I'm just ready for this to all be over and I've just been neglecting everything I've been wanting to do including YouTube but I told myself I can't let my feelings get the best of me so you know what we're just gonna ignore I'm just gonna ignore my emotions and all that at the moment and just focus on y'all how y'all doing so today we're going to be talking about Victorious now one thing about Victorious is that um before I even get started this fueling hatred that y'all have for Victoria Justice is disgusting and I'm so tired of seeing it please stop ever since Netflix dropped Victorious. I've been, this has been constantly on my mind and I'm so over it and everybody on the internet because y'all are bandwagoners. That is one thing I have learned. Y'all do not know how to learn and think for yourselves. Like, now we all know how Victorious is kind of like a trending topic now because Netflix has put it on. Why, before we even get started, I just kind of low-key hate and I'm cokey kind of happy that it's acceptable to watch Victorious because I used to get picked on in middle school for watching that show because apparently it wasn't cool to be watching Nickelodeon while you were in middle school. But yeah, uh, so now it's cool to like the show. Anyway, I'm, I, anyway, let's just go, let's just go. But yes, Victorious, I was more of an iCarly girl, wink. If you... If you've been here for a while, you know about the iCarly stuff. That is my all-time favorite show. But Victorious was pretty good, too. The first two seasons. So, uh, it's just this one ongoing thing that's been getting on my freaking nerves. And it just goes to show you that y'all don't know nothing. Y'all don't. Like, y'all, people invest so much of their time into celebrity lives and celebrity drama that they just kind of... They just get a little too mean and too disrespectful. And y'all just need to shut up sometimes. So I see how everybody hates Tori from Victorious. Now I honestly, it honestly really surprised me that a lot of people hated Tori because I liked Tori. I tolerated her. She wasn't my favorite character, but I didn't think she was terrible. She was just a normal girl to me. She was just there. She wasn't unlikable, but she wasn't like my favorite either. She was just there. And it turns out that like some a lot of people don't like Tori. I'm not going to tell them that they shouldn't like Tori because who am I to tell somebody what fictional character they can and can't like? I hate when people do that. So a lot of people have come to the conclusion that they do not like Tori Vega. But a lot of people are talking about how they don't like Victoria Justice too. And I just need to go off. Do not get your hatred for Tori Vega mixed up with your hatred for Victoria Justice because y'all dislike Victoria Justice for no freaking reason and I can't freaking stand it. Y'all dislike Victoria Justice over an assumption of what y'all thought. Like, I remember when I was in middle school and in high school that there were a whole bunch of rumors going around and I would hear people in class talking about how Victoria Justice was a bully and she used to do this and that to Ariana and she used to pull out her hair and I was just like, what? Y'all literally believe everything okay y'all literally believe anything that people put out on the internet because i remember everybody was saying victoria justice was the reason that victoria's ended and i was like to be honest i really think it's more than that i don't think it's that and even if it was that the last two seasons were crap let's go ahead and admit it the last two seasons of victorious were terrible so it needed the end I noticed it's mainly like Ariana Grande stands that have started that. Ariana Grande stands are some of the meanest people I've ever encountered on the internet. Let's just go ahead and put that there. Like they feel like Ariana Grande can do no wrong, which is a lie. And I'm I'm a fan of Ariana Grande, not gonna lie, but I will admit that she has done some things that I don't agree with. And it even came out recently, Ariana Grande came forward and said, y'all need to shut up. Y'all don't know nothing. That's not what happened. Y'all just made that up yourselves. Like, I'm thinking just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. It does not concern y'all. But it's just so many people dislike Tori Vega. And they're just pushing that hatred onto Victoria Justice. And it's so ugly and I'm so tired of it. Because I actually, I will admit, I am a pretty big fan of Victoria Justice. I don't dislike her. I never had a reason to dislike her. I actually loved her. Like, at one point, I was like a really, really big fan. Like, my favorite songs from Victoria's are sung by her. I thought she was a great singer and everybody was just talking about she couldn't sing, yada, yada. 
Y'all know good and well that y'all can't freaking sing, so shut up. Like I, like I said earlier, I'm not gonna tell you who you can and can't like. It's just, it's so freaking ugly. I just don't get it because I don't understand how y'all don't, y'all cannot tell the difference between fact and fiction because this is not the first time that I have seen y'all bully a fictional character and the person that plays them because this has happened plenty of time. I mainly see it, see it happen with all characters of color, like specifically Lucas from Stranger Things where a lot of fans didn't like Lucas and they started being mean to Caleb about it and that is unacceptable and I'm like, you can just like Tori Vega all you want but do not come out here and give hate and negativity to the girl that played her who did absolutely nothing like it's been proven that it was just false rumors and whatnot they cleared it up they obviously made up y'all get over it there is this little feud that y'all have in the back of y'all mind between Ariana Grande and Victoria Justice is no longer existent it's non-existent and if it was it's no longer existent get over it I'm getting really irritated with this video because my camera keeps cutting off and I don't know why. So if I'm getting more and more angry, that's why. Now, like I said, the internet has this burning hatred for Victoria Justice because of Ariana Grande. Now, y'all are not going to like what I have to say about this, Ariana Grande fans. I'm going to need y'all to stop thinking that Ariana Grande is perfect. She's not perfect. She has flaws just like everyone else. Y'all think that she can do no wrong. Like, y'all treat Ariana Grande like she is God. She's not. Like, whatever they had going on, they resolved it. They put it in the past. It's over. It's done with. Get over it, okay? Like, they were in their teens and early 20s. I'll go ahead and tell you this now. I'm at that age, and y'all, we're all stupid. We're all dumb. We all make stupid decisions, okay? I do stupid things. I do things that I regret. I do things I shouldn't have done. I say things I shouldn't have said. I don't know. I'm dumb, okay? I will go ahead and admit it that I'm dumb. And I still got some growing up to do. I may be grown, but that don't mean I got the life... You, you know, you, you know, you know, you know. But it's like, everybody has this burning hatred for Tori Vega, and I don't like it. Like, first of all, I'm not going to tell you who you can and can't like when it comes to fictional characters or just people in general, because everybody has their own preference. But I didn't think Tori was a terrible character. As much as y'all don't want to admit it, the show would not have worked without her. She was the main character. If we took Tori out of the show, it wouldn't have worked, okay? Get over it. But everybody just seems to hate her. They always talk about she's the worst character. She's this and that and the third. And a great part of me feels like the only reason they're saying Tori Vega is terrible is because they really don't like Victoria Justice on the side. Like, like I said, whatever beef her and Ariana Grande had or if there any even is, was any, who even knows at this point? Because you know what? It's, it, it's not that serious. It, it's really stupid now that I think about it. This whole entire thing is dumb. And even if Victoria Justice was the reason why Victoria's ended, it wouldn't have made a difference because the last two seasons were trash anyway. Like, only the first two seasons of the show was good. The rest was just terrible. Like, y'all, if that show kept going on and on and on, it would have just gotten disgusting. Like, if anything, I think the most dislikable characters on Victoria's were Kat and Jade. They irritate my soul. I could not stand and them uh, especially when they were together sometimes I just couldn't deal with it like I hate girls with nasty attitudes like Jade and I don't like stupid characters either I just couldn't and Sinjin can go up there too with the characters I hate it and Rex and Robbie it's a lot of characters you know what this show is just full of characters that are just unlikable but for me Tori was not one of them <laughs> but you know what that's my rant and I'm done I love you guys. Don't forget to follow me on everything to keep updated on how I'm doing in quarantine because I'm not okay. I'm not. I'm hanging in there though. We're all hanging in there. Like, if y'all need to hold my hand, please do. I need somebody to hold my hand. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I love you guys and goodbye.